Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Prehistoric Kingdom Alpha. My name is Swoop there and looky here. It is a new map. Oh my lord, I haven't seen a blank map like this for so long because I've been working in my other alpha park which has since come to an end. So today I am going to be completely transforming this map into a desert theme. Um, doing a little bit of terraforming, might put a couple of oasises in, and I am potentially going to build an entrance. We'll see how much time we have. If there's no time for an entrance in this episode, I shall film it for the next episode. But um, without further ado, I'm not going to talk for too long. I'm just going to jump straight into a complete episode of terraforming this map ready for my new mini park thank you for tuning in thank you for subscribing thank you for all your support in the comments and i will see you after the speed build bye What did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life, fast forward, never turned back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you.
Okie doke. Well, guys, welcome back from the speed build. Here we are in the little park that I have um, terraformed just quickly, like pretty simple. Haven't really done anything fancy with the rock work because the chances are as I build around it, it's probably going to change. Um, but if I zoom out, you can see I've built this kind of mountain here. I don't intend to build anything behind it whatsoever, and I probably won't head over this side either. I'm really going to stick to this side of the map, sort of around this lagoon kind of area i'm probably even going to put like some barriers to kind of map out where the mini um park is going to be so that like this mountain will be part of the like barrier the natural barrier and then i'll put like a barrier across here i'm going to I'm going to largely ignore this entry point that they've given us for prehistoric kingdom. Um, it is required for guests to actually come in and out in alpha. So I'm obviously still going to have it left there and then I'll have a long path sort of heading towards the park eventually. Um, but my entrance point is going to be more sort of over this way. I think I'll probably have it like either by the lake and then an implied car park over this side or I'll have it here and then you kind of can walk into the park and there are some habitats over this side and also just a few habitats over here in the desert side. Anyhow, that is the um, the map, I suppose, that we are going to be building in for the next couple of months probably. I'm looking at probably doing between... 10 and 12 habitats in this particular park. Most of them are going to be smaller habitats. There will be a couple of big ticket dinosaurs um, coming up in these, I mean, in this park, more so just to kind of bring in the guests. So you kind of want these guests in to see these big ticket dinosaurs and then they also traipse around and have a look at all the other little ones that you've got happening. Um, I'm going to be building quite a lot of... Um, I guess viewing areas and a lot of pathway viewing I'm trying to keep this uh, park itself quite simplistic and really kind of like um, a park that you would sort of stop by as you were going somewhere else or it wouldn't be like a huge massive amazing park that you would come to to kind of really check things out like the last park that I built and actually spend like a full day in this is kind of going to be more of a small sort of modest park more of a modest budget that they've got and they're just doing the best they can so that's what I'm looking at doing for the next couple of months thanks for sticking with me if you've subscribed in the last week whoa um the amount of people that have subscribed has been incredible if you're interested in sticking around to see this little project unfold and you have seen this episode that means you are here from the beginning so um it is a shorter episode because it really just was me getting the terrain ready the next episode will be the entrance because i knew that if i built it today it was just going to be an extremely extremely long episode um which i'm finding that people aren't really sticking around to watch a great deal of the video that i'm putting out anyway so i thought i will split it up into two smaller ones that way people might enjoy staying a little bit longer and just seeing my um, thought process and my design process thank you for commenting thank you for subscribing and thank you for liking i hope you have a great day or night wherever you are and i will see you in the next one bye guys